Yo, hello everyone. Are you ready to have a business that offers services or appointments? Then having a booking right with this feature is very important. So join me guys in this video as I will go you through the adding of a booking calendar to your Wix website in 2023. Streamline your appointment scheduling and enhance user experience. So let's get started. So guys, before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you get the full information. So guys, as always, before we get to start with videos on Wix or any other platform, we need to get to this platform. So here is the Wix official website, as you can see in front of you, which is www.wix.com. Here I'm going to click on login and they will take me to this page where I'm going to sign in using the Gmail feature. You can use either Facebook, Apple, Gmail, or just use your normal email sign up or sign in uh, process. So here, as you can see, I have been logged into the site. And this is like the main page where you are going to be uh, like facing all the different kind of website that you are already having. In case you didn't have one, I have made already a video about how to make all types of websites on Wix. Well, for now, as you can see in the main page of mine, there is the create a new site. So for those who doesn't own a website, you can simply click here. There is so many process to go through. Uh, in case you didn't know how to do it, make sure to watch my previous videos on Wix. So now let's go to one of my websites. For example, I'm going to this my site three. So let's click on it and then let's go to the dashboard so the dashboard will be opened automatically and now what you will have to do is wait for the dashboard to load for you and then there will be a button that will allow you to go to the page builder of wax in that specific page we can literally build manage and change anything in our website so i will go to the dashboard and then i will be right back here I am guys. So next thing, as I said, is this design site button that will allow us to go to the page builder. So click on it and then wait for the other page to load. Here it can take some time since the page builder uh, have a lot of features. So that can take some time as well. Here, as you can see, it is loading for me. And the same thing, I will let it load and I will be right back after it finishes the loading process. And here I am, guys. Now I am on my website and here I have all the page builder, builder uh, features. So here, as you might see on the left corner or on the left side, I have add elements, add section, pages and menu, site design, add apps, my business, media and CMS. Click on add elements and here you have to like look for the bookings. So here we have it in the bottom of the page. So click on bookings and then click on add to sites. Add in Wix bookings to the website. So just wait until this uh, loads until it finishes and then you will be ready to start editing on your Wix bookings feature. So here it is, 4 on 5, and in a bit it will be 5 on 5, and I will be ready to go and show you all the different details that will be on this feature. So now it has already uh, opened my Wix bookings over here, as you can see. And now, as you can see, I have this page. So. Get booked online, add your services, and start taking bookings. So the first thing that we need to do is to create our first service. So I will create a service real quick, as you can see here. Let's wait until it is fully loaded. And then we will create a random service. So here, uh, virtual constellation, for example. I'm going to go for it. And let's give it some time. Let's keep it as it is. And then save anyways as you can see or else if you don't want it to be saved you can go to this add the pricing add etc stuff and much more so let's fill everything that we need to fill and let's click on save all right now we have saved our service 
let's close this and let's go to another step which is set your work hours so let's set our work hours and when people can actually make an appointment and when they can actually book so I'm going to go with that and then I'm going to save and next so we are not really given like too many uh, important to the details since it is not mine my preset is not going to be yours so you have to go through all of this and change it as you like so all of these details are actually going to be yours not mine that's why i'm not really going through them and here finally what you have to do is connect a payment method which will help the others to actually pay you through this method so as you can see here we can simply get paid and then you can actually um, get paid through the Wix bookings here you can manage the services add services manage services do everything through that section over there so the same thing that I've shown you you can manage booking page as you can see um, so the bookings is going to be like that the booking calendar uh here it is so everything is actually have been made for you directly you don't have to do anything just by the information that you have provided wix with as the type of service the money that you are the like the cost uh, the work hours the location and all of that they will be submitted into this page everything will be correctly made for the customers so when a customer like orders or made an appointment or booked an appointment in 12 a.m no other person can actually do the same appointment in the same day at the same hour they have to go for another one or another appointment and as you can see guys it is as simple as that there is nothing complicated that you can fear about this platform uh, everything is easy here they are showing you like uh, if there is any day that you have to manage it every day that you work on is actually going to be uh, filled or blanked um, here as you can see people if you have multiple locations people can actually start filtering by location and if you have too many members or staff people can go and filter it by their favorite member on your team so they can actually go directly to them book to that person not to any other person so it can be random it can be really very filtered by the client themselves you can all do that through this booking uh, with Wix feature so as you saw in this video it is very easy not complicated at all just put all the information co correctly and put it organized and this page shall be working perfectly on your website and for your clients so yeah guys that was it with today's video thank you a lot for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial